Tara Heiss was an American women's basketball player. A 5 foot 6 inch, 1.68 M, point guard who played college basketball for the Maryland Terrapins from 1975 to 1978. She also was a member of the 1980 U.S. Olympic team and played in the Women's Professional Basketball League. She was inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame, the University of Maryland Athletics Hall of Fame, and the Maryland State Athletic Hall of Fame. Many consider her the best point guard in the history of U.S. women's basketball. Following her playing career, she was an assistant coach at Maryland and Towson University and worked for 20 years for FedEx. Heiss was inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame in 2003, the University of Maryland Athletics Hall of Fame in 1998, and the Maryland State Athletic Hall of Fame in 2011. Heiss died on July 8, 2023, at the age of 66. No cause of death was given recently. Patrice Awissi was a French professional boxer who competed from 1990 to 2000, challenging for the WBC cruiserweight title in 1996. As an amateur, he competed in the men's light heavyweight event at the 1992 Summer Olympics. Awissi died on July 8, 2023, at the age of 57. No cause of death was given recently. was a Mexican politician. He was one of the founders of the Party of the Democratic Revolution, PRD, and served as ambassador to Cuba from January 2022 until his death. In 2005, he returned to the PRD to join Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador in his presidential campaign. In 2009 until 2012, he again served in the Chamber of Deputies as a deputy for the PT. On August 27, 2018, the Parliamentary Group of the National Regeneration Movement, Morena, proposed him as President of the Chamber of Deputies and therefore of the Congress of the Union for the first year of the LXIV Legislature. In late 2020, he ran for President of the Morena Party, but came in second place. In January 2022, he was appointed Ambassador to Cuba. Munoz Lido died on July 9, 2023, at the age of 89. The cause of his death was not immediately announced. Roy Heron was an American politician, attorney, and author. He was the chairman of the Tennessee Democratic Party. He was the Tennessee State Senator for the 24th District for 16 years and for 10 years before that the State Representative for the 76th District. He was the 2010 Democratic nominee for U.S. Representative for Tennessee's 8th Congressional District. The Senate District encompassed Benton, Decatur, Henry, Henderson, Lake, Obeon, Perry, Stewart, and Weekly Counties. In January 2015, Democratic activist and former candidate for State Senate Mary Mancini was elected to succeed Heron. Heron and his wife had three sons, John, Rick, and Ben. The couple lived in Dresden, Tennessee. On July 1, 2023, Heron was injured in a jet ski accident on Kentucky Lake. He died at Vanderbilt University Medical Center eight days later, on July 9th, at the age of 69. Tommy Mahler Nielsen was a Danish football coach and player. He was the son of Danish national football team coach Richard Mahler Nielsen. Nielsen played for Odense Bold Club, Chobenham's Bold Club, B1909, and OKS. As coach, Nielsen managed both B1909 and Viborg FF during his career. He joined Rangers on May 27th. 1997 as first team coach to replace the departing Davy Dodds. He stayed there for three seasons before becoming Ebby Skavdal's number two at Aberdeen for just over a year. Nielsen returned to Denmark and to be 1909 as coach in 2003 then took up the offer of being Ov Christensen's assistant at Viborg FF. He was a replacement for Fleming Nielsen who had been promoted to sporting director over Christensen. This was one of the reasons for Christensen's departure in the autumn of 2006. 
Nielsen became the head coach of Viborg FF until the end of the year and was replaced when by Anders Linderoff in January 2007. Nielsen then returned to his previous position as assistant coach, but was sacked along with Linderoff later that year. On October 24, 2011, he succeeded Aurelius Scarbalius as manager of HB Coke. He was sacked on September 3, 2012 following a poor start to the 2012-13 season. Nielsen died in July 2023 at the age of 61. No cause of death was given recently. Sir John Kuljevic born was December 31, 1966. Sir John Kuljevic was a Serbian screenwriter and film director. He was five films writer. Kuljevic died on July 8, 2023, at the age of 56. He created five films. No cause of death was given recently.